Poverty is a great barrier to many children in completing school. Furthermore, not all barangays have schools or even proper transportation systems to help children access basic social services. To support children's development and alleviate child poverty in the Philippines, organizations such as Child Fund Philippines and FACE Incorporated have taken initiative to serve children in poverty areas in the Bicol region. The Federation of Associations for Children's Empowerment Incorporated, or FACE, a local partner of Child Fund Philippines, initiates and implements various programs in 31 barangays in Pili in Camarines Sur and in Bulan, Irosin, Matnog, and Sorsogon City in Sorsogon. One of the programs implemented by FACE Incorporated with the support from Child Fund Philippines and the local government of Pili, is the Mobile Supervised Neighborhood Play, or the SNP, an early education program that supports the infants and their families living in remote villages through the use of a mobile unit. The mobile project aims to increase the local government support for home-based ECD program, design and equip one mobile SNP unit that will deliver mobile SNP program to target sites, deliver 120 hours of ECD sessions per school year to target sites, and increase knowledge, attitude, and practices of caregivers in proper child care. Four barangays were selected as target sites of the mobile SNP. These are Barangay Palestina, Barangay Kadlan, Barangay San Jose, and Barangay Curi. By virtue of a memorandum of agreement between the LGU of Pili and local partners involved in the implementation as an innovation to existing center-based and one-site SNP ECD program by setting up tents used as learning spaces for children instead of permanent learning centers. Studies in the Philippines show that only 2 to 3 out of 10 children less than 5 years of age have access to daycare or any form of early childhood education. This kind of situation is more challenging in remote and conflict-affected areas, where access to early learning is much lower due to lack of resources, difficult terrain, and low awareness of parents about the importance of early childhood education. Sa kababagitan po ng supervised neighborhood play, at dahil po very mobile ito, at sa tinong natin very innovative, ang mga mga ilang mga sa bayan, ay nakakapag-employ na at na natutuwa sila dahil hindi na po nila kailangan ng doon sa center o sa data center. Sila na po mismo ang ating pinupuntahan. Parang ito po pala hindi sa mga ibang may mga lugar na po na ako. Ang sabi yun, mayo pong mga daycare centers. So, kung yun pong SNP, yun po kumuha po kami maray dahil uh, mismo ang iskila na po ang SMP ang nagluluman sa sarong lugar na dahil pa po naabot kang daycare center. Gen Fund and Faison ang nag-provide na po kami sa toya po mga duwang maestra. So siguro yan po yung Samoa na ang mong NGU pili mo po uh, uh, we provided yung uh, driver so kada-apay uh, bank and driver tapos po siya po itong Maintenance kato po ng sulina at maintenance kayo sa pong auto na sunod ito po na itik na inaraka ng SMT. Conducted by parent volunteers or child development workers who attended a series of training sessions and seminars who are mothers themselves are trained to facilitate the SNP with the help of the local government of Pili and the Municipal Social Welfare and Development Office. A checklist is provided to help teachers monitor and assess a child's development in various domains. The Mobile SNP, as an early childhood development program on wheels implemented by FACE Incorporated, working with Child Fund, indeed places the foundation for a child's own development, especially their life skills, knowledge, experience, curiosity, and confidence. Together with Child Fund Philippines, FACE Incorporated, and the local government of Pili, there is a strong need for communal participation 
to help bring to fore these remarkable changes in the lives of young children and their families. Let us help children face the challenges for them to face the future.